hello everyone you are welcome back to this tutorial so here i want to be showing you common dragging and dropping of your video clips uh adding new clips to the timeline as well as positioning the clips and cropping them so these are the few beginner touches you need to do on your video clips to reposition them reshuffle them or arrange them in such a way that you can continue with the editing so when you are downloading the app initially you will just be looking at them it will it won't be difficult but the way you are looking at it as a beginner it will look as if the thing is so difficult now one of the first thing you are going to do is that after you must have added the clip like we did it in the first video let's say the clip is too long i did this before but let me just repeat it now let's say the clip is uh, covering the areas where you don't want as you just add it this is how you are going to have it like this and then because you don't want the initial part to be there then you may like to cut them off and then how are you going to cut them off i i did this in the previous video but i noticed that i was actually kind of fast and then i said let me redo it clearly so that you guys can understand it better first of all immediately add the clip you will now touch on the clip just touch on it once so immediately you touch on it you can see that there is something that come out at the beginning i mean at the beginning of this clip here so that particular white stuff it allow you to trim the video that is to adjust the length okay where you want and where you don't want you can see what i'm doing here so now by before you touch on that and you'll be able to walk you will first of all need to tap on the video clip which is in the center of that this in the space there once the white stuff come out you are not going to position your finger just one of your finger on the white stuff and then long press as you position it just leave your finger there firm don't you leave it there for some for a while like just just one two seconds and then you start dragging it dragging it now if you are dragging and it's not working then it means you didn't position your hand exactly on it so your hand needs to be on exactly that white stuff so from there you can drag it like this and then you just um drag it to any way you want to trim that video that is option one of trimming the video alternatively that will be the other option that we treated in the first tutorial you can just take that you can just press your hand over the video clip and then you don't don't long press just touch it and then take it to the left and right that is why you are, you are you are dragging it to the left and right so it's now going to be moving the clip moving the clip moving the clip and then it will take it to the place that you want so we say we are going to start on the hand clap bam so this is it here so once you reach there you now click on split so imagine you click on split do not say delete yet put your hand on your screen down your screen then take it to the left tap on the video on the timeline and then you click on delete so you are now successfully deleted the initial part which you don't want so with this option you can actually do some trials and error while recording on camera but you can actually come in here and edit that unwanted section out you get hello so everyone you can see that it's starting exactly at the hand clap so that is it let's say there is a part inside of the video that you still don't want it to be there this is what you are going to be do, to do. You now play the video. So when you get to that part, let's say I want to remove the part where by C. I can okay, remember some time back I did a video about landing cost calculation by C. But based on uh, at some point, let's say I want to remove that part where I open my hand. Let's say that was a mistake. The opening of the hand was a mistake, and then I want to remove it away. I will just take the video to where my hand was closed last, and then I will tap on the video, click on split. And then I will see, take the video to the right, to the right, to the right, and then where the hand join again. Where the hands join again. Yes, I will now click on the video again, and then I will click split again. I will now touch the unwanted part and then click delete. So the video will now continue from where my hands was like that and then take to the other side so that is how it's done now let's say you are doing all this and then you make a little mistake let's say you make a slight mistake you deleted something you don't want to delete that doesn't mean you're going to start the entire project again afresh no you're just going to come on these two arrows here i mean these two curve 
pointing to the left and to the right the curve pointing to the left is undo why the one pointing to the right is redo undo simply means what you just did now the changes you just did now you want to move it like you want to bring it back let's say as i just delete that video now i noticed that oh it was a, an error that was what that was not the one i was supposed to do so I'll just click on that arrow so you can see that the clip has now been returned this particular one has been returned so if i still want to redo like to go back to this thing that i've just done like this and then you can click multiple times so it will just be undoing the changes undoing the changes you can see the cut that i cut set there that times they just i mean that time they just remove it just return it back and then they return this one too back now as you are redoing it as you are undoing it let's say you notice that it's a mistake you want to still return back to the other stage just click on redo and then you see, click on redo again your changes will come back so you just take your time and then i will advise that you find a short video clip and practice this particular stage before we proceed so that you will actually master the whole of this and then another thing i want to show you in this video quickly before we end the, this particular tutorial is that of uh, cropping your video this you have recorded a video and then you notice that there are some certain parts of that video that you don't want inside that video now there are some parts that you don't want so what you are basically going to do is that you're going to click on the video meanwhile you may like to do the cutting before coming down to trim the video because when you get the right positioning then from there you will be able to get the right cropping too now let's say i want to just crop a single clip and then have a straight position or a fixed position i will just tap on the clip on the timeline and then i will from down here i will now start scrolling always scroll always scroll and then i will click on transform so under transform i will now click on resize so under resize i will now start positioning it the way i want i will just position it position it like that i hope you guys are seeing the difference just position it like that and then let's say i want to remove this calendar completely together with that other stuff there and then why cropping it ensure that you the center the subject the subject of a video is that particular person in action ensure that the subject is uh, in the center of the video you get let the subject be in the center that is good video clip so you now click on what uh mark here so you can see the difference so the you can play it and see landing cost calculation by c so you can just from here bring it out again and then take it down so it depends on any how you want it you just uh play around with the whole thing so you can take a look at the difference now this particular clip now is give is giving more focus on my face and is a closer shot this is what we call a close shot okay it's more closer than that other one now you can use this same method to change different kind of shots like open and close shot now see this one now it just went back to open shot again so and i'm going to add a transition here please don't get overwhelmed we are coming to transition okay now see what is going to happen just watch and boom the clip will now change to a different shot so that is just very very simple to do when you are done you just click this particular arrow up here to uh download the video or save the video but i don't want to do that for now so i will quit it you get so that is just it and then concerning the video quality you can see where you see 1080p here you click on it and then you reposition it as you want 720 this will be a laser size of the video but the quality will reduce 1080 that will be the higher i mean the high quality that will be higher than 720 but more capacity more like more size the size of the video the file size will be bigger and when you take to 4k 2k to 4k that is the highest you get so 2k to 4k is the highest and then that is going to give you a larger file size. You can see the size that is being estimated down here. You can see it's reducing as I'm taking it backward. So they are compressing the quality of the video and then they are giving you laser um, 
the laser file size so the higher the quality the bigger the size that is just how video editing is done generally so that is it for that and then i will see you in the next tutorial